Hi guys, welcome back to his Tea's Dawn Room. So by popular demand, I had a gentleman by the name of Raymond leave me a comment on my last video and he expressed that, you know, he wanted to see me just play with the dog I already have. So I had a few, I have a few repairs and I have some new things that I've gotten in the mail and I have not the box yet so I decided well this will be a good opportunity for me to show you some of the things that I have been looking for for my dolls and I finally acquired them and how I want to incorporate them into play with my collection so starting off we've got uh, Tantric Lucas here he's one of the uh, jewels of my collection and when Integrity just had their Dolly Days for Christmas, you know, for the holiday sale, I was able to get the Love is Love gift set. I primarily wanted those, not for the Hobbs dolls, but I wanted those tuxedos because I've been wanting some real uh, well-fitting, tailored tuxedos for my Hobbs guys for a long, long time. So what I decided to do was to buy the set while well, it was on sale for $150 and it's still on sale on their website for $150 and you don't have to be a W Club member in order to buy that set now. So I bought the set and what I have done, I actually sold off Cabot Clark, I sold him new and then I have uh, Milo up for sale and that helps me offset the cost of the $150 plus shipping gift set just so I could get all the clothes, shoes, and accessories from that set, which is what I wanted in the first place. So we will dress Lucas in his tuxedo. And then um, in unpacking my dolls, I have Nyasha Lauder. She's one of the Color Infusion dolls and she's wearing a, an outfit from one of the previous conventions and the heel on the boot broke. So I need to glue that back on. But I love this outfit on her. She's, you know, it's kind of 70s inspired fur coat and the wrap dress and some uh, nice brown boots. And y'all know how I feel about these boots, so I'm not taking the boots off, but I am gonna repair the heel on the boot for the doll. So we'll be doing that in this video. Let's see, um, my storage tips for how I um, house and how I uh, keep up with my collection of shoes and different things like that. So I'll share that with you in this video. So let's get started. All right, so I wanted to show you all the components of the tuxedo sets that I got out of the Love is Love gift set. So we have some uh, floral brocade tuxedo pants and the jacket comes with a pink looks like cotton dress shirt and then we have the other tuxedo and it has like a woven floral um, pattern in the tuxedo there we go bow tie white dress shirt and here are the accessories here so I have another bow tie these cute little magnets on them that keeps the bow ties shut together. And here are the dress shoes. These are some lace-up dress shoes. Socks. We have some eyeglasses here. A ring, wedding ring, and a watch. And we have some loafers with the um, little gold detail there, and a gold watch, and a ring, wedding ring. 
and we have a cell phone and the invitation and announcement to their wedding. So I thought for the money and the fact that I'm selling off the new dolls to defray the cost of the $150 price tag, it was a win-win. So we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put the black tuxedo on Lucas. I'm gonna use these shoes with that, the gold. And we'll just accessorize him. See what we're gonna put on here. All right. So let me get Lucas out of his clothes. And as you know, the Homs. Their shoes, their, where their feet come out of the um, shoes. I have to run a little hot water over them to get them out of the actual shoe. He got his hoodie from one of the broad Ken dolls, fashionista dolls. pair of uh, Heather Gray sweatpants. He also got from one of the fashionista dolls. That's fitting perfectly. And off with his hands so we can get his dress shirt on. shirt tucked in and for that I use the flat end of these tweezers here to get his shirt tucked in neatly all the way around. And it's useful to grab onto the zippers and pull the zippers on. I love the way the little magnets on the bow tie just claps together.
I'm using a little E6000, which will pretty much glue anything. Uh, plastic, wood, leather, glass, acrylic. So I want it to stay on. And basically, it's a little dab of duty. Wiped off the excess. for a couple of minutes on there. pretty good hole. We're not going to stand her up on there. We'll just let her sit out front. <clears throat> Another thing I got in the mail, actually got in the mail today, I saw this in the remit group. And some of you may know that I collect remit. Um, I haven't been doing as much recently in the last few years, but I love the little housewares and things like that. So I ordered this set from Japan. And it came today. Cost me about 15 bucks on eBay. Uh oh, what is that? Hope it didn't break. But these cute little tabletop or countertop ovens figures. It's called Toffee Miniature Figure. And you get a set of three tabletop ovens in shell pink, pale aqua, and ash white. And then you get the electric kettle in the same colors to match. And I thought these would be great for my Kenmore kitchen, particularly the aqua one, since that group, that uh, Kenmore kitchen has the aqua appliances, um, windows, excuse me, on the cabinets. So this is the one I really wanted. And Oh wow, the oven door opens and it has little racks in there and baking sheets. I'm trying to see if this little rack comes out. Okay, oh wow, so there's a little rack in there. And when you pull the door out, it pulls the rack forward. And then these are like two little square baking pans or trays to go in the oven and you close it up and it goes right back in there. So that is too cute. Anyway, 
I want to open the kettle. I think they have a couple more. I think one of them is a, a coffee maker or something. I want to try to get those sets too. So this little piece goes here in the bottom, and then this is the top. That's what it looks like to me. Yeah. Got the rest of the kettle there. That's like the little attachment for it to turn on, electronic cow. I think that is way too cute right there. And this is the ash white set. broken this one. Okay, so the handle did break out, so I'm glad I got my glue out. So I'm gonna glue that back on. We'll fix that. Okay. So this one is ash white. Okay guys, so that was part one of my little play session. Paired a the heel of the boot on the color infusion fashion and I put Lucas in his tuxedo and minus his socks and his ring. And um, I also showed you guys these little appliances that came from Toffee and I broke one in the process and then I glued the little handle back on. So we're gonna let that sit up. If you have any questions um, or comments, please feel free to leave me questions or comments. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. And one of these days when I get around to redressing some of these dolls, I'll do a video on that too. And thank you for tuning in. And y'all have a good day. And I'll see you back in the next video.